Um Mu'min says that somebody has a cab and he's asking about taking drunk people from and to the bars, whether it's permissible or not. Remember the answer which we, uh, or the ayah which we normally rely on to answer questions similar to that, second ayah of Surah Al-Ma'idah. Allah the Almighty says in this ayah, وَتَعَاوَنُوا عَلَى الْبِرِّ وَالتَّقْوَى وَلَا تَعَاوَنُوا عَلَى الْإِثْمِ وَالْعُدْوَانِ this segment of the second ayah answers all the questions concerning assisting others in doing what is halal or what is haram. Selling what is halal or what is haram. Working in a segment which have halal and haram. Very simple. وَتَعَاوَنُوا عَلَى الْبِرِّ وَالتَّقْوَى You should assist one another in everything which is righteous which is pious, to achieve what is pious. وَلَا تَعَاوَنُوا And do not cooperate, do not assist one another in committing sins or transgression. If I know that I'm taking this person to a nightclub, am I allowed to do that? If I know that I'm selling knives, and I know that the person is buying a knife, to slaughter somebody, to kill somebody, to stab somebody. Am I allowed to sell it? the same knife? No, in this case, I'm not allowed to sell it to him. So my judgment would tell me this is haram and this is halal because of the involvement. Will I be assisting somebody in doing halal or haram? Even in some Arabic countries, I was in some countries, and uh, just leaving outside the masjid, then I was shocked. There are... Uh, girls from different countries hanging in front of the masjid where boys come and pick them up. Then they stop a cab. Then they go together to wherever. You know, it's like Las Vegas. Okay, and that was right in front of the masjid. The cab driver, you've seen that. You know the neighborhood. You know the girls. And you have seen her repeatedly picking up customers to get involved in an illicit relationship then in this case, you're not allowed to assist them. Well, somebody will say, yeah, Sheikh, if they, if they don't take my cab, they will take another cab. If I don't pick them up, there are hundreds of other people who will be happy to give them a ride because such people, they would be like intoxicated and they would pay extra and they don't care. I don't care. I don't care about others. I care about myself. كل نفس بما كسبت رهينة. I don't care about others committing the sins if they choose so. Don't misquote me. I care about myself because I'm responsible and questionable about my personal choices, not about others' choices. That is the meaning of لا تزير وزرة وزرة أخرى. You cannot say but others are doing this or everybody is doing like that. And this is what is common nowadays. No. You are responsible for your choice. When Wabisa ibn Ma'bad came to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, the Prophet, peace be upon him, said, Jita tas'alu anil birri wal ithm. He came to ask about what is halal and what is haram, what is righteous and what is evil. He said, yes, ya Rasulallah. In the segment where he answered what is ithm, what is a sin, because we refer to Surah Al-Ma'idah, number two, وَلَا تَعَوَنُوا عَلَى الْإِثْمِ وَالْعُدْوَانِ Do not cooperate in committing إِثْم and عُدْوَان transgression. And we say that إِثْم is a sin. What is forbidden? You want to know what is الْإِثْم? He said to Wabisa, may Allah be pleased with him. He said, الْإِثْمُ مَا حَاكَ فِي نَفْسِكَ وَتَرَدَّدَ فِي صَدْرِكَ وَخَشِيتَ أَنْ يَطَّلِعَ عَلَيْهِ النَّاسِ Al-Ithm is what you do not feel good about it. And you're afraid that good people will find out about it. You're afraid to tell your wife when you go home that today I picked this woman uh, or I picked this prostitute and a guy and they did this and this and that. You know that? You knew that they are bad, right? And you facilitate that for them and they give me a big tip. Can you say that to your kids? Can you say that to your parents? No. So this is Ithm. Something you don't feel good about it, 
you feel your heart like congested if you still have iman of course people with some iman in their hearts will find that feeling but people with dead hearts they will not really mind kalkuzi mujakhiya their hearts are like upside down la yunkiru ma'rufan la yunkiru la ya'rifu ma'rufan wa la yunkiru munkara what the not recognize what is good and what is bad only whatever he likes is good and is halal and whatever he does not want to do, then it's bad. May Allah guide us to what is best. These social media sites are the best way to contact us from anywhere around the world. Stay connected with Huda TV's latest news and programs through Facebook, Twitter, Google+, YouTube, Skype, and Instagram. It's fast and easy. Stay up to date with your favorite shows and scholars today. Buddha TV, a light in every home.